everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for joining me today. So we're going to get straight into this. Um, I'm hoping Louie's not going to be too wretched. He's being so rotten this morning. But I wanted to share two pieces with you guys. I hope everybody's doing well. We are going to get straight into this. And I've, ha I've wanted to use this for a while. So here we go. As soon as I saw this, there's just some pieces, you know, that you just can't get out of your mind. And as soon as I saw this, um, I knew I wanted it. So we'll stick that there. Louie, have at it, baby. Um, so this is how it came. And it is, don't eat that, Lulu. No. The Louis Vuitton. Um, that doesn't look right. It's got two sticker or two tags in it. But we, I've seen a recto verso um, wallet or a card holder. Um, but here it says P T E C A R R V M N G Noir, um, and that's what it says on both of them. So I will give you the product information in the event that you are interested. It's of course got the textile card and let me give you a close up. He is going to town on this box. Hang on Lulu. Not everything's made for your mouth there buddy. All right so this is what it looks like. It's got this compartment right here. I think this is such a beautiful functional piece. Then of course you have the interior. It zips entirely around and then you have your key ring holder and then you've got an open compartment there. You can put cards, you can put cash. We'll stick this back in here. I don't know that I'm going to be putting a key fob on or a yeah, um, on there, just because I don't think it's wide enough. I want to use this more so as a wallet, but you've got one, two, three credit card slots here and one down here. And I will put in some things, some items, so you can see what fits in there. I'm totally enjoying my um, Chanel, that, that zip around the new card holder with the pockets, which I'll show you in a second. Let's stick this back in here. And then, of course, you guys, you can put some stuff right in there. All right, chill out, mister. Um, so we've got about five, a little, about five and a half inches across right here. We've got from the very top of this where the zip is, you've got about three and a quarter inches from the very top here. It's not super, super wide. I won't even bother with the depth or the width, but um, yeah, not super wide. And then we also have, I will go into what fits in there in a second. Then we also have, that's hubby. Let me grab that real quick. Y'all, Luby is being so wretched this morning. He's nipping at me. He's trying to, Oh, he's biting my heels. He's biting my tush. He's just biting everything. He's driving me crazy. All right. So I've been wanting this piece for a while. I really did want it in a color, um, but I had to, I don't want to say settle, but I ended up going with just the classic color because every time I'd go to get one that was a beautiful color, it was just gone. So I'm like, let me just grab it while I can. But this is how it came. I do have this one in the Louis Vuitton Mon Monogram, um, and I love it, but I just wanted something a little more classic, and I absolutely love these. I've been eyeing these for a very long time. Um, here is the product information, and this is the Chanel Passport holder and it's in the black of course with the silver or the ruthenium silver no it's the silver hardware what's up buddy one two three four it's got four slots here it's got a little compartment here um, a compartment here and that's where the 
authenticity card is and then it's got one here so I'd more likely put my passport card or my ID right here and then just a credit card or something um, a few credit cards or whatever right in here but I absolutely love this it smells amazing but it's just the quilted squares it's beautiful and I don't know what the leather is Louie chill bud my goodness what is this Oh, it is the ruthenium, I was right. So it's got the ruthenium hardware. Um, it's 20A, black, no size. Um, it doesn't say it like the leather, so I'm not really sure. I would have to check on that. Um, but it's such a gorgeous piece. Okay, so we're gonna get back to the Recto Verso um, card holder or the key. I don't know, I, I don't, honestly, I don't know. Um, I know it's recto verso, but like on, you saw the tag, it was something completely different. But I'm just going to take out what I've got in this gorgeous, and I'm going to hide that. But this is what I'm using. Let's see. Right now. And the Louis Vuitton is longer. Did you grab something, mister? You want to say hi to everybody? You want to say hi to everybody? You want to come here? You want to say hi? Cutie pie. Why are you being so wretched today, huh? All right, so I would always put my most used credit card. I'm going to go ahead and put my driver's license in the front here. I will put a credit card right behind it. So we've got these two right here. And then I'll put my triple A card in there because you always need your triple A card. I'll put that behind the credit card. So these are my most needed um, cards, obviously. And then I'm gonna put my insurance card in that very third slot. So this is what it looks like, fits perfectly. In here, I don't even want to try and take my key fob out. I don't think I'm going to put my key fob in here. This, you guys, is made in France. It's Louis Vuitton Paris, made in France. Let me show you. I do love the France pieces. But it's right here. And I've been really bad about telling you where the day codes are. Um, I used to do that all the time. Um, so here I would just put, I think in this Part in this slot right here, sorry, he has got me so distracted. So I would put receipts, I would put like gift cards, those types of things, and maybe like a house key or something like that. Um, but like I said, the key fob, not so much. And then you've got room. There's some more. Come back in there. Um, so in here, I would put, let's see what I would put in there. Um, so my husband, my stepdaughter is severely disabled, so I always carry her, um, her ID with me as well. So I'll stick that in this pocket right here and I'll put her insurance card in there as well. Fits beautifully, as you can see, right in there. And I think that's the most I would put in there. Now in this front compartment, so we've got one, two, three, four, we've got six so far. Let's go ahead and put just two additional cards and they're just gonna be credit my American Express cards. I'll put those in. So you've got one and two in there and I'm just gonna close that up. There's no, oh, there's no strain. I hope there's no information on there now. There's nothing, um, no protruding, no strain, nothing. You guys, I love the smell of leather. I know that's so weird. Um, all right, so one, two, three, four, five, six. So I've got eight cards in there. And I think this is pretty comfortable. I could easily put, let's see how many I could put in the interior. I've got one, two, three, four, Four. Let's put four more in the one, two, three, four, five. I'm putting five more in the pocket right here. And that's totally in the way. Let me get this 
this key ring out of here. So we'll put that in there. And those fit pretty comfortably. I would leave that out and just put my key fob or my house key on there uh, or what have you. Um, I forgot how to do these. How do you do these? I gotta figure that out. I'm so bad at those. Um, but yeah, it fits beautifully. And I would just leave this, like I said, out. But I put, was that five more cards in there? One, two, three, four. That was six more cards. So it all, um, in total, I've got 10, 12. So I've got 14. That's incredible. That's a lot of cards. Um, and it's not straining. It's just a beautiful, beautiful piece. I really like this. I'm really glad I got my hands on this. Um, but yeah, that is it. You guys, I just wanted to share these pieces with you. Um, they're not super hard to get out. I'm taking them out. The ones at the top typically are, um, cause obviously you've got these other cards in there kind of in the way, but, um, yeah, it's a beautiful, beautiful piece. I just really, it just spoke to me and I really wanted it. So I'm so glad I got a hold of it, you guys. Um, and I love the um, passport holder as well. Let me give you a good look at these again. So there they are, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I know it was pretty short. I just wanted to share these pieces with you. If you guys have any, I'm obsessed with the smell. Um, if you guys have any questions, oh, and this piece was made in Italy. Let me show you right here. I'm so okay with that. Oh, my card just fell. But yeah, if you guys have any questions, please leave those down below. As in all my videos, my information will be down below. You guys, I do have so many items I want to sell. Um, yeah, I was going to try and put them on... I might have some down below. I'm not going to like put it on the video. I don't think not for this one, but I might have some down below. I'll decide that um, in a little bit, but I do have a lot of pieces. I'm just not that person that wants, sometimes I look in my closet and I get really overwhelmed because there's so much and I'm like, I'm not using these as beautiful as they are to look at. It just seems senseless to me. Tell me if you guys are like that, please tell me down below. But I just, I, I feel a little bit overwhelmed sometimes. Um, I do these days, I'm much more casual just because I'm not, you know, going into work and I'm pretty much home, you know, taking care of our stepdaughter, you know, with Louie. Um, I find it so hard to leave him. Like he's so, such a mama's boy and oh my goodness, like I feel guilty. It's ridiculous. It's like he's my fourth child. Like it's, it's absolutely ridiculous. Um, but, uh, yeah, um, yeah, I guess that's it. You guys, I really, really, my goal is to have videos up every Wednesday and Saturday. I'm really going to push for that. That is something I can easily do. Um, so that's, that's my goal. So we'll start today saying every Wednesday and Saturday, expect a video up. I might do more. Um, but, um, yeah, I was going to say, I'm really trying to grow my channel. I love doing this. I really do. I will tell you, um, I've been watching Lisa Lisa D one's like, um, videos and I just, they so resonate with me. I'll put her channel down below. Um, but they so resonate with me because I've been, there's so much I want to talk about on this channel. Um, and sometimes let me know if that's something that you guys want to do too. Cause I did say, you know, I cured my asthma. I really want to talk about that so badly. Um, and just other things like I started the keto diet and I, I guess it would be like dirty keto. I'm finding that I don't like to eat a lot. Like I, especially when it's not that time of the month, like I have zero appetite and that's not good. Um, that's not good. And just the frustrations of, you know, you know, God gave me a certain body type and, you know, I'm not one of those stick figures by any means. My shoulders are so much broader than I'd like them to be but it is what it is. You know what I mean? I'm healthy. You know, I'm here another day. It's such a blessing. Um, so I try not to focus on like flaws and things like that, but you know, you see, you see things and you're like, Oh man, like how come I'm not getting those results or how come, you know, this or that. But I too, I do try to have, you know, just that, um, 
the attitude of gratitude and there's so much to be grateful for but I really want to get into kind of discussing things with you guys you know some different topics um, like I said let me know if that's something you guys are interested in because I'm totally I would totally be interested in that I'm so looking over here and I should be looking over here it's so hard not to um, but yeah like if you guys have any video requests please leave those down below I feel like I'm rambling at this point um, and yeah, I will, will be back with another video this week. Like I said, Wednesday and Saturdays are my goals, uh, for weekly videos. Um, uh, but yeah, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share you guys. And I will see you on my next one. Take care.